Do y'all remember Flappy Bird? That game from 2013 that just absolutely grabbed us by the soul? If you don't, you're probably a child and were just put into this world. So let me give you a quick recap to catch you up. Flappy Bird was a free game on the App Store that was released in May 2013, but it really spiked in popularity in late January 2014. It had very simple game mechanics. All you had to do was tap anywhere on the screen. That is your one option. Your objective is to make sure this little guy doesn't hit these things. The more pipes you avoid, the higher the number goes up, but if you hit a pipe, you have to restart from the beginning. It was an incredibly simple game, which really helped win every one found out about it. I was in the fifth grade when I found out about Flappy Bird. In fact, I had only had my own personal phone for only about a month at this point, so I was of course like, ooh, you new game to play on the phone. I immediately was hooked by this masterpiece of a game. My friends at school would flaunt their high scores, and of course I would too. I was so proud of myself for reaching 118, and for all I knew, no one had beat it, until my best friend Grayson showed that he had a high score of freaking 365! How? Immediately I worked to try and beat this high score, which proved to be a very, a very difficult task. To reach 100, you had to be sitting down and doing that for like, a while. One day on the way to church, I had gotten really far. I had soared past 100 and then 200 and then 300. I could actually do this. Remember, all I had to do was get past 365 and those bragging rights were mine. We were about to turn into the church when we hit a bump. I had a miss input, miss input! And my bird hit the pipe when I had the score of, I kid you not, 364. I was not happy in church that morning. Eventually, and actually really quickly after Flappy Bird blew up, the creator, Dong Nguyen, I'm sorry if I mispronounced that, I'm so sorry, removed it from the app store. He did this because he felt guilty about everyone's addiction and overuse of the app. Which, dude, when creating a game, don't you want people to like it? Dude, come on. You started this party, don't poop on it. On top of this, some estimates claim that Flappy Bird was probably receiving around $50,000 in revenue every day. Since Flappy Bird blew up in late January and the app was removed on February 10th, you can add that up to a stupid amount of money. Dom, what are you doing? Nevertheless, the app stayed on everyone's phone that had already had it, so it actually didn't go away. In fact, it kind of made it better. Now all the ads were gone. Those stupid, dumb, stupid mobile game app. After early 2014, everyone kind of forgot about Flappy Bird, myself included. Minecraft was my jam, baby. It's all about Minecraft, baby. I love Minecraft. Kill those mobs, mine those diamonds. I love Minecraft. The only reason I'm thinking about this is because I found an IO version of it online, and let's just say I'm not as good as I used to be. We got freaking Flappy Bird, Flappy Bird. Oh boy. Just, just shaking the dust off a little bit. Dude, I got my swagger back, dude. Dude, why is this so easy to me? It's like coming naturally. This is just like, um, this is, uh, just like, just like, I can definitely remember why this was so dig I'm a dick thing. Cause I mean, like, look how simple it is. It's just a little bird, it's a little pixelated. So it's like, oh, come, okay, look, I was trying to make a point. It's a little bird, it's a little pixelated, you know, it, it, it's a lot of fun. It's really simple and stuff. Okay, here we go. I used to always feel so epic when there would be like a really, uh, okay, double digits. Woo. Oh, bump, sir. 13 is my high score while doing this in front of my YouTube people. I'm not gonna be, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I don't even know what to say here. Like if people like, if people had like Flappy Bird Let's Plays, then you know that they were the most boring thing ever. Cause it's just somebody trying to play Flappy Bird. There's really not that much you can like say about it. Just other than uh, game fun. Ooh, I'm so mad. Ooh, we, oh, mm. oh. This is actually not that bad. This is kind of cool. Oh. Okay, this is getting dangerous. I feel like I could actually get the high score because I'm like zoned out into it. Wow. Ah -ha! Okay, we're doing one more. See, but we're gonna go, go go for the high score one more time. Just uno, one more. Yeah, okay, I'm not good, I know. But I promise I used to be good at it, I swear. Anyways, Flappy Bird was really fun. I enjoyed it, 10 out of 10. Wish it would come back someday. That's, that's all I wanted to talk about. Bye.